Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another daily vlog. <laughs> Starting off another vlog today. How are all of you guys doing? I'm doing pretty blessed. Just, you know, uh, got up, took a shower, and uh, had a little bit of morning cafecito already. And um, right now I'm just kind of like chilling. Today's like not very, there's not very much to do today, but I wanted to start a new vlog today. Um... I don't really have very much to do, no cleaning today or anything like that. I did have a little bit of laundry to do, but I don't know if I'm going to do that today. So, I don't know, we'll see. But, um, yeah, so this video might be like a nothing video. We just do whatever and stuff like that. I do have to go outside. Do you hear that? I don't know what's been going on, but all morning long, um, there's been a helicopter, like, surrounding the area. I don't know if it's a rescue one or if it's, like, an actual police one, but, or just somebody driving their helicopter around or flying their helicopter around, but it's been going pretty for a while now, probably for a few hours, you know what I mean? But, um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, I do have to go outside and water my, um those plants that I got from my sister and then I was gonna try today if I can if not I'm probably just gonna have to wait um to trans to transfer them into these buckets that I got from the into these um pots that I got from they're like the plastic pots that I got from the Dollar Tree um so I have to see if I can transfer those because I have to come back to my sister this week, the little containers that she gave them to me in. So hopefully I can get around to do that. I, she was going to give me some potting soil, but I told her no thank you because I thought I had some here and I don't. So I might just transfer them in the way they are, but I want to make them deep enough. I know that if you mix the dirt with their actual soil they come with that they'll grow but at the same time like I wanted to get like at least one bag of fertilizer so that I won't shock them so hopefully hopefully you know it works out and I don't shock them that's what I'm nervous to do right now but they're outside they're thriving they're getting some sun they're getting some air and my flowers died you guys I don't know what happened um one of them is still kind of good but you could tell like she's about to go you know what I mean and the other one just like bye girl <laughs> you know what I mean so um I don't know what I'm gonna do with those I'll probably just throw them and then clean out their vases and start all over again later but um I was so like you know only had them for like a couple weeks you know what I mean and for them to die like that but I think because over the last few weeks it got so hot in here that you know, that's why we got that cooler now, and um, it's so, so good now. Even though the mornings and, like, the last day or two haven't been so uh, hot, so I've been leaving it off and just opening up the windows and the curtains and getting some sun and some, you know, nice cool breeze from outside, inside, airing it out in here and stuff like that. Um, you know, like like um the heat it got pretty hot in here for them and they kind of wilted so i had to put them outside see if they got you know how they were gonna do and stuff like that they didn't do that great one of them did pretty good one of them didn't do all that great though sorry i'm checking my <laughs> and my messages and stuff like that on here but yeah so anyways anyways i know i'm uh, a little talkative this morning um don't really have very 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 much to do today like i said i'll just go check out my plants and stuff I'll go do that in a little while. I want to do that this morning, though, before the evening time comes because, I don't know, I feel like giving them that water this morning and seeing what I can do with them, 
and them getting the beautiful sun that we're having right now. <laughs> it's supposed to get cloudy here in the next couple days, which I'm like, no, no more rain. You know what I mean? But, um, so I'm going to see what I could do with that. I might even bring them in too because I don't know how they'll do in the rain. I know that my last one from last year, sorry, that's something in my eye, uh, from last year, they did really, really good. But, um, you know, I don't know. These ones, I'm barely going to like, you know, repot them so i'm running late on them guys i wasn't gonna do a garden to be all that honest with you guys i wasn't gonna do a little garden but when my sister gave me those i was like i got the itch i wanted to do it again so i'm gonna go ahead and just try these ones out maybe next year or the following year will be a little bit better for me maybe i'll get a little bit more invested in it but this year i was just like no i don't want to do it i don't want to do it because First of all, uh, I just didn't have the funds to do anything with, you know, buying pots and buying little things that I needed, fertilizer, all that stuff. So, I thought I had some already, too. So, I don't know. Anyways, I'm talking. Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> um, let's just, uh, I'm just going to take you along with me for the day and see what we get done and what we, uh, see what we do. So, welcome. <laughs> Okay guys, I was actually finishing up my coffee seat though and I was actually about to run outside and go um, check on those plants and stuff like that. Um, and I have a little cat running around here somewhere. <laughs> I don't know where she went. I she This cat is weird. She, I don't know what it is. She ha likes to hide out in our washroom from time to time and I can never find her. And I'm like, where is this cat at? Like, you know what I mean? And I always catch her in the um, washroom window. I mean, we have, oh, here she is right here. She's right here, I'll show you her in a second. Well, I think I already showed you in the morning clip, but she was not here with me. Hey, um, but um, yeah, I had uh, what she, we have like windowsills. She can sit in any windowsill she wants up here in the living room, you know what I mean? The dining room, whatever, you know what I mean? But I guess the one in the washroom is a lot bigger for her to like, you know, really sit out. She likes to sit up there. So every time I can't find her, that's where I find her. <laughs> but right now she's up and thriving and running around here like she's having a good morning. So <laughs> she's having a good morning and she wanted to come up here. So I let her come up here. I would show you some of her. I'm gonna. But my floor needs to be vacuumed, you guys. And I'm not gonna vacuum right now. Then there's hairballs from her I gotta pick up. So. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Having an animal, right? Having an animal. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go outside and I'm going to do that and I'll take you along with me. Okay, this is the damage that is going on here. These plants definitely need to be watered. And these plants definitely died. Except for these ones. I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, look it. Hello, little mama. <laughs> She's like, huh? But, um, sorry, it's going to be loud out here. But these ones definitely like wilted. Oh, hold on. Okay, I hate when I'm about to do something and my phone rings. <laughs> so that's what happened. But I was gonna just clean up these. And um, these can get refertilized. I could throw these on the grass. And they'll kind of like refertilize the grass. But I'm gonna have to deal with those later. These I'm actually gonna take out of this box and set on the table here. And instead of watering them inside this box i'm gonna water them outside the box and i'm gonna water them first leave that right there i'm gonna water them first and I'll let them get some air some more and then maybe by tomorrow because i don't have to give these like the little container the little containers back until like maybe a day from now i hear you mom i'm coming back in she's on you <laughs> so i brought my little water and i'm just gonna give them a little bit each in all honesty i might have to go back in there and get more water but i'm gonna give them a little bit though i don't want to drown these babies because when you drown them then that sets you up for disaster so maybe just in like that much but see how they're like soaking it all in <laughs> You want to make sure that you give them a good amount of water. I might have to go back and grab a little bit more water. So, I will do that. But, for now, they're going to get that amount of water. And it's okay if I did the water here. Sorry, it's loud out here. There's traffic, as always. But, um, yeah, so, in the next day or two, I'm going to move them to these. Let me show you. I got um, these 
containers here I leave them right here because I don't want like anybody to come up and take them from down there but I need to poke holes in them and you see how deep they are I they are gonna go in these my sister actually gave me the idea and then I could set them like this and then I have like all six of them inside of this little thing here and then I'll put them somewhere maybe over here these ones didn't work out uh two of those are broken i will oh there's my water spout i was looking for that i didn't know i left it out here i'm probably gonna refill that instead of the glass <laughs> with water will give me more water and then that there that one's still good but i think i want to plant flowers in that one not <sighs> actual plants so we'll see but my porch is gonna have some plants i want to add more plants to this area here more greenery these flowers can just stay out here for right now, like I said. But these got a little watering. I'll probably go back in and get some more water. This is what I was talking about. And then eventually I'll clean this porch up and set them up over here somewhere. So I don't know if they'll fit. They'll probably fit over there. But And then I'll move that one down here. Uh-uh. Hey, hey. She knows they're getting a bug or something. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to go inside, but I just wanted to show you this. I'm actually going to get grab my mail, and then I will come back and um, check on these boys, bad boys right here. Uh, well, I'm going to get water first, water them, get my mail, and then go in there and chill. So, yeah, that's where I'm at. So, you guys are going to go with me to check my mail. Mail time, mail time, mail time. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It is a hot day today. It's pretty warm, but it's beautiful out here, though. The yard needs to be cut again, but it's looking good. There was a butterfly right here a second ago. But let's go check that mail. Look at you guys. My flowers over there died. I don't know if you can see them. They died. There's only one. And there comes that helicopter I was telling you about. Look. Can you see them? Here it comes. It's going to fly right over us. You get it first in action. I wasn't lying. But, like, yeah, look at them. Disturbing the peace over here, sir. I don't even know if it's a, a police helicopter or what, but... I don't know. Anyways, he's been flying around here for quite a while, so... I don't know what he's doing. Oh, he's disturbing my dog. Alright, let's check this mail. Hold on, guys, I gotta get my key because I do have a key for my mail so let me get my key out okay okay the mail guy came and my dog went nuts <laughs> I'm gonna turn away because I don't want to give you my address sorry if you guys don't have it like that and actually there was no mail so why did the mail guy stop I will never know all right well I guess I'm going inside and no mail <laughs> but it is sure is beautiful out here Look how green it got in our yard. So green and pretty. So beautiful. The sun popped out. Alright, I'm going inside. But look at my porch. <laughs> it needs to be clean. Look at my mama at the, the door. It needs to be clean, but welcome. <laughs> I need This is the project I said I was going to do right here. It's fix it up with some greenery and my plants and stuff. Oh, look at You guys see this table right here? I got this, I found this table, and I'm actually going to uh, refurnish it. I'm going to uh, paint it. I have some extra paint. I'm going to paint it white. That's going to be another project and another video. I got to clean it up first, though, and then it's going to go into my house. Somebody was, was commenting, saying, oh, you have, like, too much furniture in your house. It's not that I have too much furniture. It's just the angles you guys get in the vlogs that, um... You know, I'm not shaming this person or anything like that because, you know, I never shame anybody. It's not right to. But at the same time, you know, I don't have a whole lot of furniture. Just the angles that I, I vlog in, it may seem that way. My house is actually very spaced out, thank you. <laughs> and this is going into a different space. And if it doesn't fit in that space because it's too big, then it's going to go probably in my backyard. So it'll be like a backyard like table maybe i'll turn it into like a coffee seat the station for the backyard whenever i'm out there or we can set like you know food on it or whatever but i'll show you when i paint it more when i paint it though and stuff like that that'll be in the vlog later <laughs> anyway going inside it's getting warm and i'm 
Oh, are you the door greeter? We gotta fix this door, you guys. It's just, you know. Hello, are you the door greeter? Can I come in? She's that girl. My house. <laughs> Butterflies, and you could see I changed my shirt, threw my hair up. It got a little warm for me out there, I'm gonna lie. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that was the project that I, I wanted to talk about that project like a few days ago, but we were so busy that I didn't do it. I forgot to to uh, talk to you guys about that. My neighbor was throwing it out and I was like, you know what? I The area that I want this little table that I got is it's supposed to be like an entry table, but I want it for the front of my window right here in the dining room. Look at it. Oh, never mind. She, she's doing her business, so I'm not gonna. Hey! <laughs> My cat is so nuts. I was going to bring our pup in, but um, he needs a bath. So he will not be coming in here today. Maybe tomorrow I'll bring him in here. Or you'll probably see it in the next vlog. Um, him getting a bath and him coming in here and stuff like that. But for now, I'm letting her run around here. She, I had to physically go get her out of the washroom because it's warm in there, you know. And um, like the door is open. It's left open all the time, you know what I mean? So she can go in and out, but she don't. She don't come out. She likes to sit on that window still, like I was telling you guys. And this is the first day that I brought her out. Well, I brought her out like several times, but um, this is like the first day that when I brought her out, she actually stays out and she's running around. You guys seen her in the vlogs a couple times before, but she, I don't know. She, she, I don't even know. Anyways, you'll see my dog probably on the next vlog because I do want to take him a little bath and... Hubby was supposed to cut his hair. When it gets the warmer months, he likes to trim his hair really short so he could feel like nice and cool. And you know what I mean? Because the animals, they do feel you gotta you gotta take them baths, you gotta make them cool down. I put ice in my animals' waters to keep them like like cool and you know more hydrated and stuff. I you know what I mean? So I like to do that for the animals. So I think that it's good when it's hot, especially because it's been getting so hot here in you know. But, um, anyways, I don't have very much to do anymore for the day, really. I just wanted to check on my plantas, and, um, the house looks good. It looks clean. I'll probably watch a few YouTube videos. I did want, I have two poppies left that I bought, uh, like, a while ago, and I think I'm going to probably drink one of those poppies. Um, I was talking to my dad about it, because it's, like, considered a probiotic, I think it's, to get it. And he was like, I don't know if you should drink those, but I'm going to finish those two off that I have. And then uh, coming up soon in the next grocery haul or something, I'm gonna, you'll probably see I'm going to try to find a different alternative for that. Maybe even some like, he was telling me about uh, kombucha, kombucha I think it is. And I was thinking about trying the kombucha. So maybe I'll grab some kombucha because that's like a natural probiotic. But I have to read up more on these. My dad, he like knows his stuff when it comes to like all this health stuff or whatever so I I kind of like ask him and then you know um but then I have to like read up on a lot of stuff myself because I'm not really sure but so I'm gonna finish those so I'll probably put one in the freezer have a nice cold you know I'll probably go sit outside for a little while because I haven't been out of this house in like three or four days you guys I've been in this house for like three or four days uh just you know here you know so I know this video is going to be a very chatty video, but, you know, I just got to let you know what's going on. Normally, I don't chat this much in the videos because I don't want you to be like, oh my gosh, she talks too much, you know what I mean? Because <laughs> I can talk for a long time because I'm here most of the day by myself with the animals when hubby's at work or whatever, and I just, I talk to you, I talk, you know what I mean? That's like talking to myself. Girl, look at her. Don't, my floor, just, just know, my floor needs, it needs some TLC, but look at her. Hey! Okay, you can't really see her. She gets camera shy. She knows. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to chill. I'm going to put one of those um, poppies in the um, refrigerator. I have... Oh, I oh my gosh. I forgot to tell you guys. I tried the the, uh, the cherry one. Oh, that one was so good. And today I'm happy because I only have like one... I've only bought f four and I have like one a week and I'm down to two. So I bought that one like two, like it's already been like two weeks ago. And the cherry one was super duper good. I have two of the lemon and strawberry one. So I'll probably finish those off one this week and one next week. I like to do one a week because being that it's a probiotic, you kind of have to go a little gentle with, 
stuff like that. So, anyways, yeah. <laughs> I just got done cleaning out my coffee, my cafecito pot. I'm gonna let it air dry. I'm gonna go get a um I'm gonna go get a rag to let me turn the light on. There we go to clean it up. I honestly love our new cafecito maker. Um oh shoot, I don't want to put it on there all wet. That's when you start ruining the the heat portion of this. But um I love it. It was really cheap and it works just you know just as good. I have to clean it up a little bit there. It gets a little coffee spillage and we just got it this past weekend. Like I said we needed a a big a bigger amount <laughs> of cafecito in the mornings because Tubby takes a little container to work and then you know I make iced coffee periodically and I have my coffee in the morning. So now that I've gone back to having coffee, throw nothing wrong with my my pods. I love my pods. I have one of those occasionally, but I wanted to give this Keurig a break because we've been using it for a long time, and I think it needs a break. I'm gonna clean it up probably, um, you know, in a couple days or so. I'm gonna clean it up real good. But yeah, I was just getting this cleaned up, and yeah, while I was in there, let me show you what I did. Okay, while I was in here doing that, I actually made some more of the tea, and it's almost done. I'm going to give it about 20 more minutes to kind of brew in the hot water. If you haven't seen, I think my last vlog or one of my last vlogs, I just put, this time though I didn't put it in the bowl, I put it inside the actual container with hot water and just put the tea bags in here, and then once I feel like it's a good darker color, like it got dar a lot darker. It was like that light down there and it got a lot darker. But when it gets a little darker, probably in about like, uh, give it another 20 minutes or so. And then I'm going to take these out, put a little bit of sugar in there, a little bit. I only put one of, let me show you. Oh, that's a flour. <laughs> I'm over here getting flour instead of sugar. <laughs> I'm not going to put the sugar in just yet, but see how small of a scooper I have? I'm only putting that much sugar. I'm not putting like two or three of those, just the one, and it's not so sugary. So, yeah, um, I'm going to let this sit for a little bit. I had it covered, but I took the cover off so I could show you guys so no gnats or any flies flying around. They don't land in there, <laughs> but it's looking good. I'm going to put it in the refrigerator, and it should be cold. And then what I've been doing lately, too, is I've been putting some of this in a water bottle, two water bottles, because it's natural with just a little bit of sugar to sweetener. I think later I'm going to purchase, um, instead of, like, that sugar, I'm going to do, like, the Splenda sugar. It's a little bit, or a little bit healthier version of a, of a sugar for this because I don't like to do too much sugar but something that tastes sweet but not sh sugar if that sugar based if that makes any sense <laughs> I'll get the water bottle and I'll put some in a water bottle and I'll put it in the freezer the refrigerator and hubby will actually take it to work as a sweet drink you know I don't I like to try to keep them away from the sodas and all the harsher drinks and stuff you know what I mean bad stuff that's bad for your heart and bad for your gut and everything else you know that's bad for you so this here is a little bit natural see these are the actual bags of tea so, yeah, you know, I had to change up a little healthier version for her because the only way that I can get him to to drink something a little healthier but that is sweet is the natural kind of way. Even though you're like, that sugar is not natural. Okay, it's not, but like I said, I'm going to get a better alternative soon. But for now, I'm just going to put one little cup just to sweeten it up a little bit, you know, just a little bit. So, yeah, I went ahead and did that tea. It looks so delicious, by the way. Two, that that, um, that, that, uh, tea isn't, like, real dark right now because of the fact that, um, I only put two tea bags in at this time. I didn't put four. Normally, I put four and it gets really dark and sweet, but last time I didn't think that I needed that. So, I'm only going to use two 
and then if it doesn't work out then I'll go back to four but I don't want to use all my tea bags up right away <laughs> but <laughs> at the same time it's a little bit of a healthier drink and it's perfect for this warm weather so um later I'll probably grab uh ice or I wanted to um I wanted to buy those like uh what are those they're like the rubber ice makers I wanted to grab some of those and I also wanted to make some ice uh some cough, uh, cafecito ice cubes as well for uh, iced coffee so I'm not you know what I mean so all I'll do is just use the cube of coffee the cube of cafecito and then just put it in a cup and then like let it kind of like melt coldly like ice and put a little bit of you know like a sweetener in it so like an almond milk or something but that's for another another time we'll figure that out when i get there <laughs> anyway yeah just a little update just doing that and um yeah that's all i'm doing guys right now i'm not gonna end the vlog just yet i got dinner to make and i want to show you what i'm making today i'm making some pieced up grilled chicken and some veggies and some oven roasted potatoes we haven't had those in so long i just put a little bit of butter and parsley and mwah, super duper look delicious put a little bit of some spray on the pan i'll show you everything later but it's gonna be super duper good so stick around for the rest of the vlog you'll want to see it <laughs> butterflies um hubby's on his way home i actually am prepping dinner right now i mixed in this garlic salt with this basil and some butter and i mixed it into these potatoes here i'm going to mix a little more and then i put uh spray on the pan and i'm going to um hold on putting that in the thing there i'm going to put them on here and put them in the oven for about 30 to 40 minutes uh preferably 30 um and they should be good and then after like halfway midway of these being done then i will cook the chicken and the veggies and then we are all set for dinner so i'll show you everything when it's completely done but i wanted to show you these potatoes because i don't know if i've showed you guys these potatoes but i just melt it down the butter you see it's melted down with that with these two seasoning basil and garlic salt and it tastes super yummy we love this the family fave so i'm gonna put these in the oven and i will show you dinner when it is completely done butterflies i got my chicken in here grilling up a little bit i just pieced it up and i'm grilling it really good i put some pepper this is like whole cracked pepper that i got a little bit of butter and a little bit of garlic seasoning and then just gave it some of that like pan spray and a little bit of this butter spray but um yeah that's all i got going on it simple easy peasy i didn't put a whole lot of salt because this salt it, this here gives some salt so that's what we're having and then inside of the microwave i have the veggies i'll show you that when it comes out in just a minute okay butterflies there's dinner we got the potatoes we got the veggies we got the chicken and then i have made a little bit of these um oven rolls i only got a couple on a little bit because i am still trying to do good and um yeah it looks really really delicious i can't wait to eat i'm gonna take hubby's plate to him and some tea and then yeah we're gonna eat up dinner and i will actually talk to you guys after we eat this yummy yummy dinner but i'm rushing and talking fast because i want it, hubby to eat it while it gets cold after dinner i'll come in here and do these dishes i already did this, this set of dishes and i packed hubby some dinner for lunch tomorrow so yeah i cannot wait to eat this it's gonna be so yummy it smells so good i know hubby was like oh you know smelling it so i'm gonna get it out there to him before it gets uh cold but yeah look at how yummy that looks he loves his pee so i did not mind making plus i had a lot of stuff that i needed to use up so that's why i've made this whole variety here